Yo, what is up boys and girls, it was a bit here. Welcome back on the channel after uh, my small YouTube break. Today is not the best day for me since uh, I have the biggest headache possible. I've decided to give up coffee and that's my second day without coffee. And, um, and you may think I'm overreacting and stuff, but this is horrible. Okay, I don't have coffee, but I have a plugin that will energize you and your beats uh, in a few simple steps. So here I have a session with a trap metal beat uh, and I have this 808 pattern right here. As you could hear, this 808 is not really heavy, not really hard, not really fat. So what you could already see right here, this is a plugin called Multi Wave Shaper. It's a JS plugin for Reaper uh, and the sound it makes, especially with the 808s, kicks and that kind of heavy heading uh, sounds is incredible. Because the problem with other distortions, other saturators I've been using was that they always added something I didn't like. But this one, this one is just perfect. Let's have a listen with and without. It's crunching the 808 in a really, really nice way. Uh, but I want to show you some other types of distortion it can make. First of all, you can process both mono and stereo, which is usual for JS plugins. Then you have three types of wave shaping. Uh, I'm using type two. Let's hear how type one sounds like. It's a little heavier in the top end. Uh, and let's try type three. It's the softest one, uh, but yet it still adds a lot of distortion. And one more time, type two. It's literally farting. And I like this kind of sound, that kind of like uh, damaged speaker. Next you have the muffle. Which just cuts out some of the uh, higher frequencies so it's not as harsh as uh, it could be but the low end stays saturated. Then you have the output, you can just make it louder. You can turn on the limiter so it doesn't go out of control and you have oversampling which is basically uh, making it a little more uh, detailed. In this case it just adds a little spice, let's say, to the whole thing. And that's how it sounds like in the mix. So to sum everything up, great plugin for trap metal beats, great plugin for all of those hard 808 kind of beats basically. Uh, because let's be honest, 808 drums and stuff are the most important thing in trap beats. And without them, trap would be just some samples and melodies and nothing else. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe to the channel with all the notifications so you won't miss any new videos. See you in the next video. My name is Dominic, you've been watching What's Beats and keep the good vibes alive. Thanks.